Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Red Stock Straight from Point Magoo, California. And today we're going to do a video review. It's actually a two pack. We got G2 versus Beast Wars. This is Baboom. And I have no idea why they changed the guy's name from the original Apache. Because that's what it says on the package Apache. You can't read it. Or maybe you can if you know Katakana. But that's his name, Apache. He's a mandrel. Little baboon look. <laughs> I get it, baboon. Alright, anyways. Yeah. Took me a minute. There's a big package. Two for one deal. You get Apache and Megatron. I might refer him to as Apache. Baboon there. Baboom. Gosh, man, this freaking irks me. Yeah, Megatron. That's G2 Megatron, and he's huge. Baboom. Not so much. Beast Wars. And there it is. Apache versus Megatron. So I'll use that interchangeable. I like the little red or orange or whatever that color is. Sunset. Yeah, it's a sunset. Yeah. There's Baboom. Yo, he has like a alt mode too, kind of neat. See if I can transform into his little alt mode, if I remember how to do that. Look at his freaking face. He's weird, he's fierce. Uh, something to be said, he is a shell former. I won't do so much on the Megatron side, so there you go. Not bad, there's good old Baboom. And I might fumble around a little bit on this, but uh, hey, I'll figure it out. And then show you the back. Megatron versus Apache versus Megatron, G2 Megatron. There's the Optimus or the, the Maximals. Right on. And there's G2. I, I don't know what the deal is with Beast Wars, Transformers Beast Wars, G2. Good deal. Okay. Man, this is a huge box. This dude's big. Uh, he looks like it's a nice size Voyager. As far as a. Uh, what do you call that? Yeah, I mean, he's big. He's got these big, huge. I love the I love the little spring gloated gimmick. I mean, it's colored well enough, and that's what's the Maximals. They had great molding, and I just love when you open up his eyes. His you know his mouth pops up. One thing about his mouth too is that see this lever right here. Click on for it, and his little he's got these little missiles over here. And see, yeah, just pop them out. Nice little spring loaded. I like how they store in their in his mouth. And yeah, most definitely, all you have to do is just pop them out. Uh, oh shit, fire. And it did, and I'm not getting that sucker, because it flew quite a bit. It does store in his mouth nice and neat, so you got that second one. So, not bad. Ears don't move too much. It's kind of neat. I wonder if there's some spring-loaded gimmick in his ears. Uh, I don't think so. Yeah, something like that. I, either way. Either which way. So... Articulation. I know that his chest is supposed to tab in. There's little tabs in here, but they don't hold too well. Uh, you can tell he's a shell former. Look at that. <laughs> I mean, they tried good molding, good blue, no uh, bright buttocks like in regular baboons, mandrills. They got the the nose really well. Maybe it's a female. I don't know. So articulation. There you go. Shoulder joint there, uh, bicep swivel, and this is mainly for the robot, so it it can get him in little poses. So if he wants to hunch down, he can. Same thing with the legs, so get waist swivel. So we're looking good. My concern is this alt mode, tank mode, or whatever the heck this thing is. So let's see if I can transform this bad boy into its alter alter mode. Yeah, because he looks like he's loaded. Yeah, let's go ahead and open this up. Okay. Yeah, it's weird. Dang, he is loaded. Look at that. I'm, I'm just going to... Put his missile. Yeah. Man, I never noticed this before. Well, then again, I don't play with this thing. <laughs> yeah, he's pretty well articulated. Look, the alt mode's kind of neat. Uh, yeah, it could could have done a better job hiding it. You know, there's no doubt about that. I'm gonna swivel this down. There we go. Yeah, it's a weird tank mode. Oh yeah, let's gonna get his fierce critic on head. There we go. That's not his real head. That's just some weird. What if this splits open? There's got to be more to this transformation, but hey, uh, 
something like that. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, weird. I don't know why he's got the the secondary head there, but yeah, he can definitely he he seems loaded for bear. They got little spring loaded the spring loaded tanks or whatever that is turrets. Yeah, yeah I'm not big fan of this mode. <laughs> Looks like a sphinx. I think I kind of got that correct. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, let me move these to the side because, you know, that would be better. So you got these big humongous cannons over here. Weird. I mean, I, that's his head for real. And I'm trying to figure out, I'm missing something. Probably should have gotten... Yeah, I'm missing something. Look, there's an alt mode. And I don't know what's weird. Let me give you... Because I'm not a big fan of this tank walker mode here, so whatever. Alright, let's go ahead and form him up to robot mode. Yeah, his uh, alt mode, it's very well designed, so I, I like it. There's his real face, this is his fake. And that's one thing, oh yeah, there we go. There we go. Now we're, now we're cooking with gas. Yeah, it splits open, I mean it's really well articulated. Yeah, I can. there we go. That's more like it. That's more like the alt mode. Where if I can get this sucker to tab in, yeah. Man, weird. <laughs> yeah, that is one weird alt mode. I'm not gonna lie to you. All right, enough about this. The dude does seem to have like a lot of articulation. So let's go ahead and fix this, shall we? Alright, so we have these humongous freaking head. It looks like he pops down. Yeah, here you go. I know this thing tabs. Tabs in right there. There's his legs. Rotate that. I know there's a reason for this. Yeah, here we go. Put his head up here. Head does rotate down. I know there's... Okay, there we go. Not a big fan of all these extra pieces. But here we go. Okay, maximal head. Rotate. There we go. Yep. I mean, it's really well articulated for what it is. Gonna put that down. Yeah, I'm flying off the cuff here because it's kind of weird. Put these little show former pieces and see what it's supposed to look like oh yeah okay gotcha probably well it's a little premature there there you go yeah that's supposed to fill out the rest of his chest so we got that Man, what a pain ball jointed as you can see Boop -a -doo -doo. Yeah, I know that's supposed to fill out the rest of his chest here. I just can't seem to get it to happen. Okay, okay, gotcha. Whoops. There we go. And that pops in right there. Okay. Same thing with the other side there. Yeah, what a weird looking maximal. I'm not going to lie to you. Alright, that goes like that. Turn that around here, and that fills in the rest of his chest. Weird. Yeah, that transformation wasn't weird. All right, still got his big missile gimmick over here in the back. So yeah, he's looking kind of fierce. If you want to extract it, so be it. All right, there you go. Man, I mean, he's looking fierce. Like the Mohawk, Apache, Baboom, whatever you want to call it. Very fierce looking I like it uh, I really do good detailing on that head I mean I'm, I'm, I'm beginning to like this line Beast Wars All right. 
Let's get this over here, even though there's a big shell former. Okay, you got ball jointed, what do you call that? Shoulders, bicep swivel, single joint on the, whatchamacallit, elbow. Wrist arch is on a ball joint. It does have a waist swivel, which is kind of neat. Ball jointed hips, thigh swivel on the top. It has a single jointed knee. And I love the feet, very, very, what do you call that, primate. So yeah, I mean, it's not bad. Definitely not a bad looking figure. It's weird in its sense. I mean, it's trying to be ambitious. All right, let's set this bad boy down. So there we go. Whew, goodness gracious, it took a while. Oh yeah, in addition to all that, the figure does come with a little trading card. So you can read that. Comes with this neat little Beast Wars. And I did this back when I did Trypticon, so Here's a little Trypticon thing. You, there's Tripredicus and I forgot that dude, the Seacons. <laughs> yeah, God Mars. That's what they called it. Uh, I forgot what it's called. Magna Boss here. There we go. All the other Predacons and Maximals, Rhinox, G2. Weird looking. I forget what these things are called. And the top secret ones. I've done this one, the the octopus. I forget his name. And Trypticon. They don't call him Trypticon. And there's the Ark. So it comes with a nice, nice little extras. And I forgot for a size comparison. So give me a second while I get these dudes. Right, very ambitious. Uh, it's not bad for what it is. I mean, he looks good. There he is with deluxe size. And four. So it's more Voyager size. He's just a little slightly smaller than a Voyager. So we'll give him that. 7 to 10 for this uh, alt mode. Very ambitious. Very weird looking. Kind of neat. I'm kind of glad that I get it. I did grab it. It is a two pack. So I'll do Megatron next. That's all I got YouTubers. And I'll catch you all next time.